Yo, what is up guys, and welcome back to another Flex Crafting video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to get the perfect Rokat Swarm settings so that your mouse can drag click as high as possible, and so that it's better for overall Minecraft use. So, the first thing you're going to want to do, make sure you go to the Rokat Swarm download. It should take you to right here. And I have the Rocat Cone Pure Ultra. So type in your mouse and then download it, and I'll show you what to do from there. All right, so once you've downloaded it, just drag it onto over onto your home screen and open it up. It should take you to this, and it will run you through a downloading operation. Just click yes to all of the things. And then once you've finished downloading it, if you type in the corner here, it should just come up as an app. Now, once you've opened this up, go into settings. Make sure that double click speed is at one. DPI, whatever you want it to be, all these things. Leave Windows pointer speed at normal, it doesn't really matter that much. You can assign the different buttons right here. So if you wanna put a few macros on the side buttons or on the top buttons, the DPI buttons, you can f you can fix or change that. And then if you want to go to illumination, you can change the type of RGB the mouse has, and that depends on different mice that may not be um, available for all. And then once you go over into advanced settings, if you have the Cone Pure Ultra, there should be a zero debounce option. You have the Cone Pro, which I don't know, I've plugged in right now. There is a slider, so let me show you exactly how that looks. Okay, so this is what the settings look like for the Cone Pro. If you go into here, setting, all this should still be generally the same, but the debounce time is what's really important. You want this to be at zero. Make sure it is at zero. This will give you the highest possibility for drag clicking. And once you've changed all the settings, then just click apply and OK, and you should be good to go. Go ahead and try that out in game and see if you get higher CPS than before. And thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like and maybe subscribe. And I'll see you all later. Goodbye.